Welcome back guys, so today we will be continuing flip flops. So today we will be seeing SR latch for NOR and NAND by using NOR and NAND. So, so latch is a bi-stable device and is also capable to store, to stay in either of the two states that is set or reset. So for an indefinite period, so we, we can actually like store the data for as long as we can. Here we will construct the SR latch. So latches are like the memory memory cell so these are used to store one bit of like data so there are two inputs that is s and r in a sr latch so the s stands for like set it means that when s will be one it will store one and r stands for reset so when r will be one then the flip flop will be reset and its output will be zero so we will see the sr latch so this is our SR node latch or the memory cell we can also say that. So now we will see, so this is the set, this is the reset input. So this is the Q and this is the Q bar output. So the both must be opposite. So if Q1, Q is 1 then Q bar must be 0 and Q, we will verify this result for this. So first of all we will study case, we will study the, like the case for it. So first of all like case 1 when we have like s is 0 and our r is 1 so we'll see what is will be the our output so suppose this is 0 and this is 1 so we know that if our like if for nor if 1 is present at the input suppose we'll make a truth table for nor gate so so this is our nor truth table and we see that whenever there is like 1 in input so it will be output no matter the other input it is so if s is 0 and r is 1 so it is 1 so this will be 0 and 0 is here and so 0 gets passed from here so our input is 0 and 0 so 0 0 is 1 so we get q bar as 1 so we see that our q is 0 and our q bar is 1 so now we have removed the inputs and we will see what will be the out, like the, rest, the new value for it. So our Q was previously our Q was 0. So 0 here, 0 past here and Z, S is also 0. So 0, 0 is 1. So we see that Q bar is 1 and Q will be this 1 past here. 0, 1 is 0. So, so it's get verified. So we can say it is memory condition. Our the previously value was has, has not been changed so it the value gets stored so it stores in the memory now our case 2 so the case 2 will be when s equals to 1 and r equals to 0 let us see what will be the output so s is 1 r is 0 so 1 so this gets deactivated so it will be 0 0 0 is what 1 and q bar so 1 will pass here we already see that q bar is 0 so this is our output now again we will see when what will happen when s is 0 and r is 0 so let us see so q was 1 so 1 passed here 1 and 0 so this will make 1 and 1 1 and 0 it will make 0 q bar will be 0 and q bar 0 has passed here so 0 0 is 1 so again the memory condition has arrived so whatever our previously output was it gets stored our new output has not been changed now case 3 so the possible case will be s1 and r1 so let us see what is our output so let us see if both are 1 so 1 and 1 1 will make it deactivated so this will be like 0 and 0 1 is again 0 so let me explain you so this is like no, not at all possible because q cannot be equal to q bar they must be opposite to each other for every case so now we will like remove the inputs and see what will be the output so suppose first we consider this as 0 for this case we consider this as 0 so 0 0 0 is 1 so like q bar will be 1 and 1 passes here so 0 1 is 1 so 0 1 is 0 so 0 sorry 0 0 is 1 so this will be 1 and this 1 pass here so 0 1 is 0 so we see that for the same condition the, there are two 
contradictory case so this is the not used case so we cannot have like different values for the same input so this is a not used case now i finally construct a truth table for it so let us see a truth table for 0 0 it was memory condition that whatever previous output it remains the same for 0 1 it was like this was reset condition now for 1 0 this was like set condition so and for 1 1 not used so this is like reset this is set condition so this was like sr latch using nor get so i'll show you how to do with by and get so this is our sr latch using nand get so the set and reset gets changed so because this is by done and get so and the truth table for it will be just the opposite of it so 0 0 is our not used condition the case which will arise something like this 0 1 is our like set condition 1 0 is our reset condition and this one one is our memory condition so you can derive all these cases by putting this in our in the, this values i will not be doing that because that will take much time so if you had any problems so comment below thanks for watching it